There was a presentation today, but it was more than the usual presentation. It was more interactive, right? It was. The event was called Walk a Mile in a Refugee's Shoes, and they say the goal is to give Tucsonans an idea of the hardships many refugees experience as they're leaving their homes. Participants walked through tents or stations, each with a different simulation. One of them was designed to show the dangers of drinking unsanitary water and how often it leads to illnesses, which is something they say happens to many refugees in transit. There was another station there as well. This one showed what a typical refugee campsite might look like. This is often one for multiple families. Now, the organizer, Neda Sumik, is a former refugee, and she and her family escaped Bosnia and Herzegovina during the Bosnian War in 1992. She said they were eventually resettled in Spain, then once again in the United States three years later. People are running away from violence and, and conflicts, and they're not necessarily leaving their homes because they want to, but this is what they, they have to. They have no other choice. And taking a look at the numbers we'll put on the screen, from October 2017 to February 2018, 8,635 refugees have been admitted to the USA, 327 of them to Arizona. Now, those numbers are coming from the U.S. State Department. Today was the first time the group put on this event, and the organizer says she hopes to do it again next year.